Parade Marshal Kenton McDonald leading the horses postward race number two, the second half of the Daily Double Condition Trotters, racing a mile a purse of $2,000. The eight lucky DJ has been scratched. Here is the lineup, the 1M16, owned by Leonard Buckner, about eight and Jeff Outdrives. Number two is Lucky and Good, owned by Doris and Steve Dennis of Thornville with Brett Merkel. Number three, Crown Time Discovery, owned by Esther Crown of MacArthur for Ryan Holton. The four is Super Stealth, owned by the Royal Wire Products of North Royalton, handled by Don Swick. Number five, Margaret Hall, owned by the Wallant Hall Limited of Lexington, Tom Sells aboard. Number six, Buckeye Ben, owned by Bernard Eckstein and Gillen Thompson of Ohio with Dave Miller. Seven is T.K. Shane, owned by the Billings Syndicate of Milhone, Bolin and Peter of Ohio and New York, Terry Milhone drives. Eight is out of the nine, Todd Tabor, laced by Jan Wolf of Bell, Florida, Brant Hinners in the Sulky. One play show perfecta and a pick three wagering. Post time at eight minutes, eight minutes to post. Second race condition, Trotters lining up, moving in. On the back stretch, there they go. And uh, they're off, and uh, first away from between horses, it's Super Stealth. Slipping away here for the lead alongside, it's Lucky and Good off the pylons, 3M16. Dropping in fourth, it's Crown Time Discover to the inside, trotting five, Buckeye Ben. Early sixth comes T.K. Shane on the inside, racing is seventh, it's Todd Tabor. And following the break, leaving, the trailer is Margaret Hall. At the first quarter mile marker, Fout has the 1M16 on the frontier, leading the way by a length. Lucky and good follows second. At the first job, a snappy 29 and four. Along the rail, third crown time discovery, followed fourth by Buckeye Ben. Here comes TK Shane, moving first up on the outside, striding out nicely here, fifth. Gamping two lengths, sixth, it's Todd Tabor. Outside seventh, super stealth. The trailer is Margaret Hall. Into the clubhouse, turn the game with M16, showing the way. Lockie and Good is now locked in a second. Milhone has T.K. Shane uh, underway to the outside, trotting a third along the rail fourth. It's now crown time discovery. They're at the half and 102 and one as they move off the turn and down the back stretch with M16 leading the way here by two. Lucky and Good in the pocket is second. T.K. Shane, 50 to one shot of the outside is first up third along the four rail fourth. Crown time discovery on the outside. Super Stealth is gapping cover fifth. Snug hold of sixth on Buckeye Ben. Two lengths seventh to Todd Tabor. As they approach the three quarters, M16 being pushed here by the long shot. TK Shane at the three quarters, 132 and two fifths. Midway to the final turn, and M16 with a lead on the inside. Lucky and good has yet to make his move. TK Shane is still a game third with one center eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch and off stride, M16. And M16 is on a break. That leaves Lucky and good a straight shot. TK Shane now to the outside looking for the upset of his life as he moves into the stretch. It's Lucky and good at the wire. Trackside, the unofficial winner of the second, the one, number two, Lucky and Good. Lucky and Good, a four-year-old son of Lucky Elmerhurst from Avalon Jill by Starlark. Oma Doris and Steve Dennis and a Thornville, Ohio. Doris Dennison, the uh, trainer, nicely handled by Brett Merkel. This is the first season's, the first season's victory for the four-year-old Ohio bred. With a new lifetime record this evening, 202, three fouls. Race two is now official. 2-7 Perfecta returning $251 even. $251. The Daily Double, 7-2, $50 even. $50.